I'm here in the Better Homes and Gardens test kitchen with my trusty companion, the Red Plaid, also known as the Better Homes and Gardens cookbook. This is the 17th edition that just came out in September, and it's chock full with lots of classics, those family favorites that have been passed down from generation to generation, as well as some new trendy foods like the Vietnamese banh mi sandwich, as well as a new twist on the Moscow Mule. Well, I made some banh mi sandwiches and I'm gonna make some Moscow mules. It's a really simple preparation on the pork. It's pork tenderloin. And so you just cut it in slices then you can kind of just mash it flat with the heel of your hand. And those are just brushed with some soy sauce and some sriracha and then the, I grilled them on a grill pan. And then we've got this little vegetable salad. Often with banh mi, those go with um, sort of a quick pickle, but these are just fresh. So we've got cucumbers and green sweet peppers and um, some shredded carrot in there and some green onion and then sliced um, jalapenos and cilantro. And then there's a sriracha mayonnaise. That's just mayonnaise and sriracha. That's all that is. We just kind of skipped pickling it in this situation because we've already got the sriracha mayonnaise. We've already got the stuff on the meat. And we thought it was really nice and fresh without the pickle. But if you wanted to have that as well, you could easily just dress the vegetables with like some uh, ginger soy salad dressing, something like that, if you wanted a little something extra. But you can skip it. And that's what we learned with this. That's the traditional way it's done, but we didn't have to. I'm going to make a Moscow Mule for you. That's a really popular cocktail because it's just super simple and there's lots of ways you can mix it up. And the cup is so much fun. It's sort of like the adult version of the Spider-Man sippy cup. I'm going to start with some crushed ice. So I'm pretty much going to fill this cup with, with the crushed ice. Just a quarter cup of vodka. Two tablespoons of lime juice in here. and then three quarter cup of ginger beer. And now I'm gonna give it a good stir. So a really common variation is a Mexican mule where you make it with a silver tequila. And something I like to do just for something a little bit fresher is um, to make ginger simple syrup and use that instead of the ginger beer and it's super simple to make. So uh, you can actually make a simple syrup where it's equal parts water and sugar and simmer that and simmer the ginger in it and then let it steep. But this is even faster than that. I just put equal parts chopped ginger, uh, water and sugar in the blender, blended it up and strained it. So ready to do a muddle with some fresh fruit. So like I hear I've got some pretty blueberries and I've got some jalapeno and that's that's good for some tequila, right? And a muddler. So I'm just going to bash it up a little bit. Smash it. And then I can add my ice to that. And for this ginger beer that I made, I'll use one ounce of that. And then I'll add club soda for my fizzy part silver tequila and then my club soda and there that is so if you don't have a, a copper mug you can use a Collins glass like this whatever you want to see get a good stir to get everything incorporated and there is that so that's a Moscow Mule straight from the Better Homes and Gardens test kitchen.